Hey guys, I just want to let you know that I'm still out here running. I've had some serious technical issues, but uh, we are going out here and we're doing our long runs, our short runs. We're running with different people and going to new places. And so I wanted to show you some of those things. I thought I'd drive around and show you little snippets of the new places we've been going and let you know that I'm still out here doing it. We're uh, we're at the half marathon point and um, we signed up for Savannah, the Savannah Rock and Roll Marathon. So let me show you where our training ground is. <laughs> Okay, the little town of Canton. Saturday mornings they have a farmer's market here. And so when you're running and you're running past the farmer's market, it smells good, it's a good feeling. All these people have their crafts out and we're running with the team and usually everyone is kind of spread out on their own down this sidewalk area here. It's a really good feeling to smell that when you're running you know you're making positive choices but it's just really pretty and it's just starting to turn light at dawn and so that's just a good tip for you if you could find a farmers market and run near that it'll get your day going correctly all right we'll see you at the next stop this is heritage park it's actually behind the YMCA up there but if you go around this loop, it's almost a mile. And so we typically finish off our long runs and then it's like mile nine, we'll go around here. You know, or mile 11, it just kind of ends up that way. We'll uh, lap it off here. And it's just really pretty. The only thing I don't like about it is this. Running on cement isn't wise. It's all that pounding and stuff. So it's like, it's a beautiful run, but it's just not wise if you're a runner. So um, trails, the softest ground you can find is the best, the best place to run, but it sure is pretty. And it's an easy way to finish off or top off uh, 11 miles or nine miles because all the other courses are uh, even numbers. So when we do 13 miles, our last mile will be here. Okay, I'm gonna show you one of my favorite places. Early in the morning, it's just really pretty. There's tractors, it's old timey. Jeremy personally says this is the longest stretch ever. But um, I like running down this. It's flat and I, I tend to not pay attention. This is where I kind of lose time because I'm just in my own world looking at everything. So tell me what you think of this stretch. places that we've been running and we've been running with new people and I just wanted to confirm I am doing it I haven't posted because of technical difficulties so uh, hopefully this stops now and I will see you next time hopefully I'll be doing if all goes well and my legs don't wear out I will be doing 13 miles I'll be good <laughs>